Hi guys, uh, Aaron from My Physio SA at the North Adelaide practice. Welcome to another one of our instructional videos. We're going to have a look at low back assessment today and some of the things that physios can do uh, to help you if you're having pain. Okay, so if you come in with low back pain, the first thing we'll do is have a quick look at your movement. Okay, so Mel's going to um, show us the movement. So the first one we're going to do is just bending forward like you're going to touch your toes. Okay, as far as you can go. Good, and coming up. So having a look, does that reproduce their pain? The next one we're going to do is hands on hips, and we're going to have a look at you going backwards. Cool, so we're having a look at lumbar extension there. Cool, and if you face this way. So now we're going to have a look at lateral flexion, so side bending, so stand with your feet apart a little bit. Okay, and just bending down to the sides as far as you comfortably can. Good, and over the other way. Good. Okay, so that's lateral flexion. And then if you have a sit on the bed uh, facing this way, and just get them to sit up nice and tall, and then we're just gonna cross your arms, and we're gonna have a look at your rotation. Good, okay, and then have a look at the rotation. Good, so Mel's doing all that movement herself, I'm not helping. Okay, so if we've identified um, some restrictions there, we might have a feel of uh, how the back is. So if you have a lie down on your belly, um, and we'll just have a, have a feel of the joints and see what, we can do. Okay, so uh, what we'll do is just have a feel of each joint um, along the side and then we're going to compare it to the other side. Okay, so we might find some stiffness at one or more of those levels. Okay, and it often corresponds to where, where the person's actually feeling sore. Okay, so we, we can find those. Um, areas of stiffness. The other thing that we might do is just have a feel of the of the muscle tension around here and see if there's some areas of tightness there that we need to need to work on. Okay, so we'll do some soft tissue release and try and relax those muscles because they often tighten up when someone's got a sore back. Okay, so that's one of the treatment techniques we do. Um, you know, another one that we'll do quite often is, is a, a mobilization. So if we find some stiff areas, we're actually going to do some gentle movement at that level okay so that's just trying to help those joints move a bit more freely okay the other thing that we'll do um, if you just lie on your back now for us the other thing that we do when we assess someone is we have a look at their neural mobility so how the nerves are moving okay so just a couple of uh, a couple of movements so the first one's going to be a straight leg raise so I just move that until I feel some resistance, and then I ask Mel about her back pain. Okay, so we're gonna obviously compare that to both sides. Okay, um, in this position, if you just bend your knees up so your feet are on the bed. Okay, the other thing that we'll do is, is have a look at someone's core activation, so those uh, deep tummy muscles that hold your spine in position. Okay, and what we're gonna do is have a look in this position, is we'll put our fingers on the muscle, and we'll get Mel to try and uh, do a deep tummy contraction. Okay, yeah, and she's activating quite well there. So in back pain, sometimes people's um, core muscles don't work as well, so we need to do some retraining. So we can uh, use an ultrasound machine and show people if they're working or not, okay? Um, so that's uh, some of the things that we do. We might also do um, a manipulation, which is a, a really quick, um, strong, um, stretch basically of your, of your low back um, but that's not our first um, treatment option like some chiros do a really quick adjustment and, and out you go um, so we do quite a lot of uh, different treatments trying to encompass a lot of a lot of areas so if you are having um, any issues with your low back if you're having pain or you're having pain down your leg um, come and see one of us and uh, and we'll do all that assessment and try and give you some ideas about where we can go from there